In this circuit, we want to find this current I through this 1 ohm resistor. Let's examine the circuit a little bit first to see if there's any simplification we can identify. The first thing I notice about this circuit is that this 2 amp source is specifying how much current is going into this side of this circuit. So this side of the circuit over here doesn't affect this current and we can ignore this part of the circuit entirely when we're doing our analysis. The next thing to notice is that this 5 ohm and this 1 ohm resistor are in series. If I combine those in series then I have a parallel combination of an equivalent resistance of these two with this 2 ohm resistor. So I know the current, 2 amps, going into a parallel combination of two resistors. I want the current in one of those resistors. That's a perfect case for a current divider. So this side of this circuit becomes a known 2 amp current from this source going into a parallel combination of a 2 ohm resistor and an equivalent resistance over here, since the 1 ohm and the 5 ohm are in series, that equivalent resistance is just the sum of those two, which is 6 ohms, and I want the current I through the 6 ohm resistor. By the current divider formula for two resistors, I is equal to the total current, 2 amps, times the other resistance, 2 ohms, over the sum of the two resistances, 2 ohms plus 6 ohms. 2 over 8 is 1 quarter, 2 amps times 1 quarter is 0 0.5 amps.